Yo, what is up YouTube man? We are back in Car Dealership Tycoon and today we're going to be upgrading my Nissan Drift car that I received from free from the Drift Festival. If you guys don't remember that video, man, I dropped it not too long ago and I hope and you guys were blowing it up, man. So we had to come back and upgrade this thing to the max and we're about to see what this what this car really does, man, after after all the upgrades. But hey, you guys already know what to do for Banjo. I'll catch you guys in the game. Yo, alrighty YouTube, like I said, man, today we're going to be upgrading my Nissan Drift car that we received for free. If you guys, like I said in the beginning, man, if you guys don't remember that video I dropped, you guys are starting to blow up that video. Um, so we're going to go ahead and actually upgrade it to the max right now. And we're going to go test it out on the Drift race. You already know what's up, man. And, and we got to see what the difference is after all the upgrades. Remember what I do remember what I said, though, this car felt very, very slow. But I ain't not gonna lie, when we were starting to do the drifts, they had a pretty smooth drifting. So we, we got to see with the faster upgrades and everything, man, we, we're going to see what's up. We're definitely going to add, um, all, every, we're going to add, honestly, everything to it, man. We're going to upgrade to the max on this, uh, but also the uh, alignment and stuff, we're going to be changing that to even drift a lot more and just honestly just make it into a ultimate drift car basically man but we're gonna go ahead and hit that race upgrade for one hundred sixty thousand dollars. not too bad but we're gonna be adding 46 miles per hour more and a plus 34 percent acceleration man so we're gonna go ahead and hit that uh turbo we, we already have a turbo upgrade we're gonna go ahead and do the race turbo which is gonna add a 30 percent uh acceleration for ninety six thousand dollars. go ahead and hit that as well tires we're gonna go ahead and just do the race tires they always say that you can do the spike tires now i'm kind of realizing why they're saying spike tires to like kind of slide on it but i've always done race tires i've always done pretty good on drifting so i'm not really going to change that so we're going to go ahead and just keep the race tires going so that's going to be for sixteen thousand five hundred dollars we're going to purchase that as well brakes man comes with street upgrades we're going to obviously go into the race upgrade which uh does give plus 55 percent more to the braking so for that's for seventy one thousand dollars and then drivetrain man uh you know what i i think last time we did upgrade it to all-wheel drive on one of my other drifting cars and it did pretty good i know rear wheel drive is usually best probably gonna be best for drifting but honestly we're gonna just go ahead and do all-wheel drive we'll just add that for a 2500 really quick man so all the upgrades are officially done here now we're gonna go into the um well, basically like doing the alignment um, and, you know, we're going to definitely add a couple different things in here. So for sure, wheels, you do want to change these up a little bit, man. Get a little different. These are I, I don't know why, but these B002, man, are honestly probably like the best for me personally. In my opinion, man, I think these are the best uh, wheels in the game. All these other ones just look weird, you know, like this one. The, the B001 will probably be the second best, but I think the 002 is probably the best ones. They have, like, the best designs. Like, it, it just looks better on these kind of cars. So, we're going to go ahead and hit that for $10,000. Uh, springs, we're going to go ahead and go extra low, man. We're going to go ahead and hit that for $13,000. Spoiler, uh, that's basically the uh, normal spoiler that comes stocked. Um, honestly, I don't really see a, a, a need to really change it. I mean... The 06 would be pretty cool, but I honestly think the original one comes uh, that that comes with the car man is actually way better. So we're gonna go ahead and leave that. Now the alignment is what we're gonna actually do. So we're gonna go ahead and add the camber into this. Um, we're gonna go ahead. And, let me see. What is it? I don't know if that. Okay, that goes inside. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go negative over here. So we're gonna go ahead and do. I think a negative five is what we usually do. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do a we'll do a negative yeah we'll do a negative uh hey now i'm trying to think was it negative six that we were doing negative 5.5 i think it might be a negative six um yeah it might be a negative six that we usually do so we'll go ahead and do negative six on both sides uh front and back and then offset we are gonna offset it and go out a little bit so we'll go about negative I'll say about negative 20 is what we're going to go ahead and do for both sides. Height, um, we're going to go ahead and just drop them down about 10. It should be cool right there. So that's going to be for $1,000. Go ahead and get that saved there, man. And now for the color, honestly, ooh, we do have an unlock. So we have a gloss. Oh, never mind. I thought we had it. For some reason, I, I don't know why I'm tripping. I really thought that meant we had it unlocked. 
<laughs> but all right, man. We're gonna go ahead. And, let me let me go ahead and see what kind of. So this gets it a brighter white. Oh, so that's the original color is like this offset white, I guess it would be. So this would be a brighter white. So we'll go ahead and do the brighter white white because it actually looks pretty nice with that. So we'll do that for twenty four hundred. Um, there's a different body. Oh, there you go. So that's the other part. So that would be the red. Yeah, we'll do a brighter red on it. So we'll do a twenty four hundred on that interior. You already know we're gonna have to do. I feel like white would be like trying to do two. Well, there's two two parts of it. So let me see. Okay, so the chairs are white. Honestly, yeah, we'll do the chairs white and then we'll do this other part red. Oh, never mind. Maybe we should have done it that way. Yeah, we're going to have to do it the other way. I spent money for no reason on that one. Okay, so we'll do the chairs. There we go. That That's better right there. So I did it backwards. But all right. Anyways, yeah, let's go ahead and get in our wheels. Wheels, we'll go ahead and change them to black would probably be. Ugh, white's not bad either, though. Imagine doing red, though. Yeah, red just ugly. I think that's just ugly right there. It's either white or black. Dang, that's that's the hardest part right now is choosing which one. The white looks super cool, but I feel like if we do white, that's going to be maybe too much white. I don't know, though. I Honestly, I think we'll go ahead and... Ah, dang, but the white does look good. And get mad. Yo, let me know down in the comments which which color should I end up choosing later, man. Because obviously I'm gonna choose one, and if you guys say the other one, I'm probably gonna have to come back and upgrade this to a different one. But let's go ahead and, and, and keep it. You know what? Let's go white, man. We're gonna have to go white on these two, man. And then calibers, we're gonna go ahead and change it with the same red as well. And there it is, man. So we got a total speed of 197 now, handling 6.9, uh, reward 57 per mile 20 uh 2493 man like i said before this car is worth four hundred thousand dollars so now let's go ahead and take this uh let's first let's go ahead and transport ourselves to the race first let's go ahead and do that first before we pop up our our brand new nissan upgraded car here man hey and we're gonna go for our record man we're gonna go for our record and try to go for uh more than twenty thousand drift points here man so here is the brand new look and I ain't gonna lie with you guys. This is actually looking pretty clean. This is actually looking pretty clean with the full white Basically all around and then the red inside man is actually pretty fire. I'm not gonna lie I think black would be looking pretty Pretty good, too. I'm not gonna lie with you guys too, man So I don't think you can go wrong with having white and black on this man, but let's let's uh Let's get straight into this man. We're gonna go ahead and see if we can do this on the first try get ourselves the most points which is more than twenty thousand drift points man so let's see what what we do out here man let's see what we do out here here we go i'm not gonna lie i gotta i gotta get used to this like i said man this car drifts very smooth i just gotta remember how how like smooth it really is you know so let, let's go ahead and get in here man so we're at 266 points you already know Banjo's about to get his points from here, man. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, yeah. Okay, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. We ain't we ain't starting too bad. I feel like the the drifting on this though does feel way better than my other drift car, man. Like I feel like I can get more control on this car than I would on the other one. So let's let's start getting focused in here, man. Let's uh let's try to get these points going up though. Come on, come on, Banjo. We got we got 50 seconds, bro. We got 50 seconds to Okay, okay. I don't think, yeah, I don't think earlier was counting as drift. There you go. There you go. Hold up. Hold up. Okay. 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 Hold up. Okay, I'm feeling something now. I'm feeling something. Let's get that. Let's get that in here, man. Okay. Man, it kind of sucks because I'm not seeing my score. So I have no idea how much time I have left. And I don't know how many points I've done. So we're just going to have to grind it out and see if we can really do our best to get these get these points out, man. See if we can pass that 20 points here. Oh my gosh, I was not even close to 20 points. Okay, so we finished off with 12,000 points, man. That's, it, it's all right. We can do, we, we're going to do one more race, man. We got to do one more race at least to try to get... 
way better than that all right let's go ahead and get in here but i can tell you right now after upgrading this car it feels way better obviously it's way faster now because like i said before it, it was just it was way too slow you know but hey we about to see what's up now man listen our this is gonna be our last chance right here we're gonna try to get our, our points in here here we go here we go come on we gotta lock in straight away straight on man come on here we go here we go here we go there we go i mean i don't really need to hit the cones but the cones obviously give you guys it obviously gives you money when you hit the cones if you guys don't pay attention to that it, it, it does so let's go let's go man we're already at eight about to hit th a thousand points right now man so let's here we go here we go here we go okay Okay, here we go. A 50. Hopefully that that score thing does not go away, man, cuz I would like to see where we at every time. Come on, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, Bando doing something. Here we go. Okay. Okay. Okay, Bando. Oh my goodness, we're already about to hit 10,000, man. Here we go. I gotta get locked in. Gotta get locked in. Here we go. Come on. There it is. There it is. Come on. I think we barely at eight thousand. That's crazy. I thought we'd be further up. Yeah, we might. We might not get to our twenty thousand here, man. We're probably not going to. But let's see if we can beat our last score. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Dang, we didn't even finish. We didn't even beat our last score. Our last score was way better. That's crazy. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like, <sighs> dang. Now I'm trying to think. Is this really the best drift car in the game? I don't really think this is though. Yo, let me know down in the comments if you guys have this car compared to other drift cars you guys have. Let me know if you guys think this is the better drift car. To me personally, I think my other car is honestly, it's obviously way faster and it feels like it drifts more. So, we're going to have to double check, man. We're going to have to see what's up next time, though, man. But, hey, man, let me let me go ahead and take you guys one last look of the of the new upgraded Nissan, man. New new Nissan drift car right here, man. So, we got it basically all white, red interior, well, red chairs, and then it's obviously white inside as well, man. We got the white rims on here, red, uh, honestly, I think those are just like the uh, part of the lip and stuff, man. I think that's like one of the hooks or something that they do obviously and then we obviously have the red calibers as well uh, and then obviously the black spoiler which is usually always black and it's always like a carbon fiber and stuff like that man but let me go ahead and take you guys inside you got like i said man this is all white and red chairs man it kind of pops with it too kind of shows you know what's up about it man but hey man other than that man i hope you guys enjoyed this quick vid like i said man we upgraded our car finally but we're gonna have to actually come back and, and honestly start looking through our garage and see which one really is our best drift car and other than that man i hope you guys enjoyed it again and i want to i want to definitely appreciate and show my love and support guy because we finally reached 500 subs on this channel man and i can't be more grateful for all the love and support you guys are showing me man hey you already know the next goal is to hit 1000 man and i know for a fact we're gonna hit it with all the with all the people that are showing up, man, new subs and everything, man, you guys are doing it, man. You guys are doing it. I really appreciate all, all the love and support, for real, man. But anyways, I'll catch you guys on the next one, man. Stay safe, stay blessed. Peace.